Hello everybody and welcome back to my Enter the Gungeon series, in which we tried to achieve 100%. In the last episode we had a pretty good run with the uh, Gilded Bullets and a first floor black chest with the Owl in it. We managed to get a few uh, mo like sort of modifiers for our Owl, uh, some amulets that made him really powerful, like basically stunning and setting on fire everything in the room. And it was just an overall pretty good run. Uh, we had a good time and I think, I think I'm going to do a challenge today. I'm, I'm going to try it. So... The, I believe it was the um, Hunter that was suggested as the character to do, to do the challenge, but I did just play the Hunter, so I think I'm going to play the Marine. Also, I find his sidearm a bit better. So, the challenge today is no chests. I, I just can't. I can destroy chests, but I can't open them. And we're just going to see how that goes. And it was suggested by um, someone in my uh, in my Discord, so when I play some Black Ops with and things like that, uh, you know who you are. Uh, and I just think it was a good idea like I know obviously we generally don't do like big challenges every now and again And it's, so, it's not something we're gonna make a habit of while we don't have 100% But I do like the idea of every now and again doing a challenge. So there's one chest and We could also get junkin so that'd be pretty cool um, Getting a no, a no chest junkin run would be pretty awesome I can still do the rat fight as normal but obviously, it's going to be a bit more scary to do it if I don't have a boss killer. So, we'll have to see what sort of things we get from bosses. We can also buy things too. So, that's, that's going to be pretty decent. But, basically, the, the gist of the challenge is just no chests. I can I can kill mimics and take items from mimics. I can destroy chests. I can buy items. But, I can only take boss items from, uh, like, to, to get unless I buy, unless I buy things. Like, that's the only way I can get items. So... It's going to be a bit of a scary run, I think. Um, I decided not to play as the bullet because I think the bullet actually makes it really easy. But something that's quite nice over there is that map man. Because map man actually gives us a really good way to get an item without opening a chest. And there's a key boy, so let's, let's go and kill him real quick. That makes things a bit easier. But yeah, the, uh, the map man is a really nice way, even though it's locked by a key, it's a really nice way to get an item without actually spending, uh, uh opening a chest, because obviously he isn't a chest, he's a man. He isn't a chest, he's a man. Now, if that ain't a quote of the day, I don't know what it is. Right. But yeah, he's, he's, he's really useful, and obviously he can give any tier of items, so he could give us a really good weapon. It'd be great if he gave us a decent boss killer. Even just the sling would be enough. Like, we just need a boss killer. Like, something that we can rely on throughout the majority of the game to kill bosses. That's that's kind of all we need as a setup. I think I can do the majority of the game with just the pistol. Um, maybe not bullet hell, but the vast majority of the game I think I can do with just the pistol. So, I think... I think it's going to be a pretty decent idea, uh, well, I'd say idea, pretty decent thing to get just one boss killer and then hopefully just get a, a few other things along the way. One thing that is going to be a shame is that we're almost always going to get weapons from our bosses because we're not going to be opening chests. Got a green chest there. Goodbye, my lover. Goodbye, my friend. You have been the one. You have been the one for me. Right, and I will destroy black chests. I hate myself for it, but I'll do it. It's a challenge. It makes me sad because it could be clone, but you know what? I'm a risky boy, and I'll try it anyways. Right, got the oubliette open, so we do have two keys for the oubliette, and we have enough to buy one. So we'll probably buy one, and then open up that map man room. Don't think so. Don't think so. And you two don't think so. But yeah, the accuracy bonus you get just it affects every single weapon, so I thought this character would be best. And obviously he starts with a little bit more health, which is always nice. So luckily that shop is like kind of shit, so we don't, we don't need to um, weigh up the option between opening Mac Man and um, buying something else. We can just kind of open up Mac Man. Right, what we got here? Another green chest. Also, I didn't want to play the robot, because obviously the robot gets the buffs from the junk, but we've done that before. Right, so, let's open up this. What you got there? Oh, yes, a bona fide boss killer. Bona fide boss killer right here. The scrambler versus the bird is, is a cool mix. <laughs> right. Just need to sort of stay back as far as we can and... Dodges shots, peek out and 
throw out a scramble shot every now and again. We can actually do that look and just fire them off at the wall and hope they hit. He's being a bit of a dick right now. Being a bit of a dick right now. I had to do that. I got stuck against the uh, bookcase and I was just like, nah, not risking it. Um, unfortunately, we just got the deagle and no um, no key. We did get enough to buy a key though and still be in a decent situation for money, so we shall do that. Um, right, let's quickly check for our secret room with the deagle. Yeah, the deagle's pretty bad. I, I generally don't charge shot either because I feel like the charge shot takes way too much time to charge up. Okay, we're not finding it yet. Could be here. I think it is here. No, maybe not. Could be in there. I'll quickly check the elevator room first, because it could be in here. Nah, it's, it's not. It's not. Could be there. Nah, it's not. Right, let's just go blank that. Shoppy shop. Nope. No secret room for us today. Now let's just head down to the next floor. So, although the deagle is okay, it's definitely not decent. <laughs> it's definitely just okay. Uh, we'll keep that ammo drop for our scrambler, because we might need it, but yeah, luckily the scrambler is like a bonafide boss killer, it, it definitely, it definitely is a boss killer, so let's actually just use this, probably fire off charge shots at the start of rooms, like that, I don't know, I'll, I'll try the charge shot, I generally don't like it though, because it's got quite a lot of knockback and not as much damage as you'd want from a charge shot, like, it is literally worse than the alien sidearm, but a higher tier. The knockback's nice, I suppose. I suppose the knockback's nice. Look at that. That's alright, that's alright. I'm I'm down for that. Come on, you. Come on, you. Gotcha. Gotcha. That was nice. That was nice. Got rid of the shotgun. I suppose it, it, it does use a lot less ammo as well, so... It makes sense. I just don't like it. Like, it's just... It feels so weak. We still haven't been hit yet as well, which is nice. We've got a flawless and all that jazz. We're on for a good one so far. I'm for a good one. But yeah, we, we sort of got a decent setup now. We need one one more like decent room clearer, and then we're in a pretty good spot. Like I said, the the pistol and even this uh, this weapon here, the the Gungeon um, Eagle, is actually okay for clearing rooms. Like we don't need much more than this, but it would be nice to get a little bit more. God damn, that was, that was scary. There were so many shots that come in there. So many. At least it's one-shotting these guys for now. That's that's at least nice. That's at least nice. So unfortunately, our old crush room is locked. So we won't be going to the um, we won't be going to there because I don't want to buy a key for that shit. And also, it would be nice to get the extra the extra junk, but we don't need them. And I did get hit there, unfortunately. And we don't need the extra junk, so I'll right, just take that for this. Um, so I don't think there's much point. Oh, it exploded. Luckily, I wasn't too close to it. Right. Poopulon. You die now. Thank you, Poopulon. Should be one shot in the ghosts, really. That's how weak it is. What? The ghosts have, like, fuck all hell. And what? And what? Yeah, nice. There we go. And we got an extra half heart there. So it doesn't matter what we took that armor hit, just in case. Would have liked to have kept it. Keeped it, kept it. That's the word. That's that. That's the English. I don't know how to speak. Uh, but it doesn't. It doesn't matter too much. We don't particularly need need it. But yeah, um, the shop is going to be like our, our best way of gaining items, I believe. Um, obviously, like I said, NPCs as well. Like they're going to be a big deal for us. Like um, the frightful challenges. Not frightful challenges. Sorry. Uh, oh fuck. Oh fuck. Oh fuck. Whoa! I didn't know you could stay down there. That was cool. Uh. That was scary. I didn't actually know I could manage to stay down there and be safe. <laughs> but I did it. But I did it. Right, we've got a shop here. What we got? Monster blood. Monster blood is very nice. Um, we could sell all, our, all of our junk. So, you get three per piece. So, we'd get three, six, nine, twelve casings. We've also got the grapple hook, which lets us steal. 
but it doesn't let us steal the rat key. You gotta gotta bear that in mind. Right. We can also sell the dungeon eagle as well. Like it's not that good. Oh, a key. That's that's nice. There we go. That's on full. Cool. Uh, yeah. Like I'm not sure. I'm not sure. We'll see about that. The monster blood is really nice just because it's poison immunity and a health upgrade. Like, health upgrades are always good. We don't need it, though. That's what I'm thinking. Like, I'm weighing up, like, how much money we want to spend on that. Because it's, like, it's like 50-something, wasn't it? Um, and we don't actually need the extra health. Poison immunity would be nice. But, again, we don't need it. So, it'd be better to keep the money and do the rat fight, I think. We we'll probably might be able to do the rat fight anyways. But, guarantee the rat fight is more what I'm saying. Stop it, poop on. Don't, don't try shooting. I don't think so. Why, why do you why do you aim assist onto the popcorn boys? You literally can't. They they can't hurt me. <laughs> gotcha. Okay, there's our boss. Scram scramble this boy. But yeah, the scrambler is such a cool item. It has some really good synergies too, which is nice. If we get it with the uh, with the weird egg, I believe, or there's a few others. I think with the uh, the chicken, it makes the eggs bigger. We had that one before, I believe, but still, it'd be nice to get it. Oh shit! Little Dodger Rooney there. Little Dodger Rooney. We'll try find a secret room real briefly, but it's not it's not a guarantee. I'm not very good at finding the secret room on this floor, as we've seen from past episodes. I barely ever find it, but it is possible. I'm going to move a bit around him a bit. I feel a bit unsafe where I am now. Oh, shit. Uh, someone recommended it as well. Like, I could do a I could do a video where I just go through boss rush and explain how to do all the uh, bosses. The shell gun's not bad, but it's also not great. Um, and explain how I do all the bosses, which is, like, an okay idea, actually. Um, right. So, Monster Blood is 54. How many casings would we get for selling this thing? Let's find out. No, no, no. That's the ammo drop. Whoopsie. I suppose that's not actually a bad idea. I, I didn't mean to do that, but... Take that. Cool. Monster Blood. Like, I was kind of weighing up, like, how detrimental would it be to lose the shell gun. But it's only got 300 ammo and it runs out of it really quickly. Like, at the minute, the Dungeon Eagle's actually doing a much better job than that would be. Because I just don't like the beam shot. It's too weak. And its pistol version just runs out of ammo so quickly. So, I think that we'd end up using it maybe for this floor and this floor only. And I'd much rather have Monster Blood. The extra health is much more valuable. And like I said, the poison immunity is good. So, if we'd have got a better weapon from the boss, then there'd be no contest and just kept it. But, getting the shell gun is like, kind of like, mm, that's just money in the bank. And I completely forgot that we can just sell the supply drop. We should do that more often. I very rarely use it. I end up just trading it away for whatever other, other active item I end up finding. So, because look, we get, we get ammo drops all the shitting time. Oh, nice. We got a care shop. That's so useful. Um, we might not be doing the rat then. Oh shit. Oh shit. This is not a good position to be in. Come on, die. There we go. But yeah, we've got a cast shop, which is just tickety boo. We've got over 100 casings as well. We don't have anything that fires water, unfortunately, so we'll just have to go in. So, what we got here? We got cursed bullets, which is obviously lovely. Um, <laughs> mimics are allowed? Is that is that cheating? That might be cheating. Um, I reckon, I reckon we buy charm horn, then we oh no no sorry we buy cursed bullets, then we buy charm horn. Then we steal Lama Configurum. I think that's the play. We'll, we'll, we'll finish the floor first, but I think that's the play. So that raises our curse massively for curse bullets. Okay, you can you can just die quickly. And painfully, hopefully. 
You keep spawning gun fairies on me, and I don't think it's quite fair. Ow. Oh, shit. Ah, oh, you bastards. It always gets me with that. Come on. Scramble should be killing you by now. There we go. Map's good. The chest is something. Something to shoot. More junk to feel fire. Um, we do have a pretty decent secret room down there, which is nice. Let's keep heading over this way. But, yeah, like, Chaos Bullets is so... It's, 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 ah! That is not fair. That was not fair. You just popped up right next to me. You shitting spider bitch. Not fair at all. Taking you to car, spider. You've ruined my party and possibly my life. Go west square, boy. Dying two hits. Yeah, two hits will do it. Boom. Bang. Thank you, ma'am. Say boom, boom. Thank you, ma'am. Right. Nice. We'll probably do that Winchester challenge as well. It just... It depends whether we can actually afford the, um... The rat key as well. Like, I'd really like to do both. But, I don't know. I probably should have taken the grapple hook at this point. But then again, like I said, I'm getting charm horn. Oh, well, actually, if I get charm horn... If I get charm horn now, I can just steal the rat key. Let's go and do that. I'll go and do that after this room. That was the dodge of the sentry right there. Don't know how I managed that. Got ya. Come on, you. Stop. Stop doing your stupid your stupid movements. There we go. Right, let's go and do that now. So we buy Charm Horn. Yep. Buy. Buy Charm Horn. Buy Curse Bullets. So now we're on five curse, because we wasn't on any before. Oh, no, no, we're on, we're on six curse, because curse bullets comes with one. Yeah, that's fine with me. That's fine. Then we could... Nah, I was going to say we should steal Lambert Configuring, but I don't think we should, because we're going to be on seven by the end of this, and then every single Lambert Configuring player that we achieve... Oh, the sling's there, too. Every single lamp that comes figure in play that we actually succeed on gives us one more curse. So we can only take like three items, maybe even less. So uh, I don't know if it's worth it. Yeah, this is going to be much better now. It's going to be one-shotting a lot of things. 70% extra damage is, is good. Very good indeed. He's already one-shotting the majority of them guys anyways, but still. Um... <laughs> No, thank you, Marcus. I'm, I'm, I'm full. I'm full, thank you. There you go. Let's get rid of that. And let's quickly destroy you. Nice. Okay, and another one here. More junk to fuel the fire. I th I, the only reason I opened that is because we got blanks for it, like we might as well. Is there any other item that makes sense to get? I would take Mimic Tooth Necklace, trust me I would, but it ruins the spirit of the challenge. Because you said Mimics are allowed, but if Mimics are allowed and and I'm getting like literally every chest is a Mimic, I might as well just play it normally. Cool, that one's done. This guy's usually fairly easy. I can't remember how you do it normally, though. Is it like... Oh, no. I've, I've got to... It's off this one, isn't it? Yeah, cool. I guess I've got to shoot one of the up ones, otherwise I'm fucked. Cool. And then I think I've got to do that again. I always fail this one. This one's really difficult. You get the bounce just right. So, if I shoot up, it bounces there. There. And then it goes too low. I need to do it as far... As far to the... Uh, left as possible, but difficult. Nah. Look at it. Green chest, though. Wait. Can I open this chest? I paid for it. 
Um, one minute, one minute. I'm gonna go look at the rules. The rules that were set to me by my good friend. Let's go have a look. You might hear my, my video play back for, for a second. So, just hold up if that happens. Right. No chest run. No opening chests. Break chests. Boss room items are allowed. No secret rooms. Fuck! I've already fa I've already failed the challenge. <laughs> uh, I've not been taking any chest things though, so don't worry about it. Damn it! But it says it says no chests. So yeah, I'll stick with the spirit of the challenge and just break it. Cool. Um, yeah, it's <laughs> it does say no chest, uh, no no secret rooms in his rules, but. Do you know what? Do you know what? I think it's okay because we've not we've not taken any items from secret rooms. It's not like we've taken any of the free chests. We just broke them, so I think we're okay. And we've not actually got anything stupendous yet. I'll just remember it for the future. Oh hello, big cursey boy. Big cursey boy. Gotcha. Oh, the ammo is good. The ammo is good. Luckily, we're not getting too many cast enemies either. I thought we'd be getting a bit more than this. Do you know what? Charm this boy. Just so he doesn't shoot us. Cool. Got him. Got him. Yeah, it's, it's nice to have the charm horn just to, just to charm enemies. Just so the... Um, that's a cast that guy. I meant charm that guy. A charm horn just so we can, like, disable enemies when there's only one left. Or just so we can get a little bit of extra damage in the room. Charm horn's a really good item. I've said this multiple times when I've had it before. But it's just... It's just good... Just one of them items that you appreciate having. It does so much for you. So it, I, I underrated it so much when I first uh, played the game. Right, Scramble should wreck up this boss pretty hard. I think it's Amaconda, yeah it is. I think I can charm his little, his little toy boys as well. I'm not sure. I think I can. By toy boys, I mean these little guys. Luckily, as well with the um, with the scrambler, I don't really need to look what I'm doing. I can just fire the uh, the scramblers off anywhere, and they just hit the wall and come back to him. So I can kind of get away with murder here. Murder of a snack. Right. He did eat one of them. He's going to eat another one in a sec, I think. Right. Yeah. He's, he's just ate another one. But he's basically dead now. Yeah. He's dead. Cool. We have a few extra shots there, but never mind, never mind. And we got the Oregoni, which is really good because we got the map. It's really good. I was going to say it's not so good unless you've got the map, but we got the map, so it's incredibly good. Nice. I feel like the um, the chance for us to steal the, the map, uh, not the map, the rat key, is just like 50-50 at this point. We, we seem to always get the ability to steal the rat key. Crazy. But this thing is so powerful. Like... As a room clearer, it's very powerful. As just an item in general, it's very powerful. Even as a boss killer, the only thing that, that like slows this down is it doesn't have aim assist because obviously it's um oh shit oh shit uh, because obviously it's um the 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 Oregon, the Oregon doesn't have aim assist so I love to control the bullets and um, the other thing as well is that uh, it what's the what's, what's the one oh it's got low ammo capacity. If ammo capacity is not so high, it's only 300. 300 is it's not a lot for a for a boss killer type weapon, but it's really nice when um when you get a gun like the Oregoni, which is just okay. It does it does the job, but it's it's just plods along, and then it turns it into like a god gun, like one shotting bullet can with this thing is crazy. Right, let's go kill, let's kill that key boy for no reason otherwise other than I want to. I don't really need the key, but I just want it. I just want it. One shotting them guys. Oh, another key. Thanks for all the keys that I don't need. Very happy about this. Yeah, like, that makes sense. There we go, look at that. <laughs> Easy street right there. Two shot. Can you believe it? Can you believe in magic? I hate this jump, it's so huge. Why is that gap so big? And thanks for the weird egg. Do you know why? The scrambler synergy and oh shit. The scrambler synergy is too good. I'm sorry, Charmhorn. Please look for our rat room as well. 
But yeah, the scrambler synergy is just too good to pass up on. I think this is the one. Let me just check. I think this is the one that just makes it fire more scramble shots. Uh, maybe it's not. Let's have a look see. The eggs are over easy. I thought it was the um, the one that makes it fire more scramble shots, but it might not be. So. Scrambler. The Scrambler. Here we go. Let's have a look at the synergies. So, bacon and eggs. If the player... Nope, that's not it. Bullet or the egg. That's the one I'm thinking of. Two eggs over easy. So, the player's weird eggs. The um, the herming shots will cause poison. The herming pellets will always track the en um, track the enemy closest to the player. Okay, so basically now we've just made it into a poison shot weapon. Okay. I'm, I'm cool with that. And weird eggs are full heal as well, so... Oh, shit. No need to get hit on purpose, is there? Come on now. What you playing at, boy? I always do this, and I'm like, the charm horn's great, but I'll trade it for literally anything that comes up. I just thought you had to for the weird egg, though. Like, synergies above all else. Quit! And a heal. Thank you. Thank you, I can't. Still haven't found our right room, I don't think. Um, what? Sometimes it kills me in one shot, sometimes it doesn't. Is it range dependent? There we go. There we go, look at that. Spicy. Where's our damn rat room? Come on, you. How will you not die from that explosion? This weapon will stay full forever. Oh, here we go. Another way to get an item without a chest. Lovely. Ha. Oh. Gotcha. Oh, the aim not having aim assist is so off-putting with this thing. Another key. Hot damn. This never happens. Without dodge rolling. Just take my finger completely off the button. And I can dodge roll. Even though I get hit, it's worth it. Very easy. What'd you give us? Oh, mega bullets. That's incredibly good with the scrambler. <laughs> that, basic, that basically um, doubles the damage of the scrambler. Because every shot is its last shot. A mega bullets makes the last shot deal double damage, but every shot is its last shot. I'm one of these dudes. Hello. Got a rat room here too. Right, let's just look for it around a little bit. Looking around. Like there's no two in my room. Can't find it. Definitely in here somewhere. Come on you. Reveal yourself. Reveal yourself to me. The fuck? I can't find it. Oh, here it is. Somewhere around here. Oh, it's it's here. I see it. I see it. Do not fear. I see it. Cool. Got a rap fight set up. I might actually just skip the fourth floor as well because... Like, I might as well, because I don't need the chests. Yeah, I don't need the chests at all, so I might just skip the fourth floor. I probably am going to do that, because it's going to save me some time. And it's going to make the episode a little bit short, which is always nice. And like, like I said, it's just, it's just kind of unnecessary. I don't need it. I don't need that extra shit in my life. So, it's basically, it's like we're doing the rat fight instead of the fourth floor, considering the rat fight actually has a way to give us items. Oh, Mimic. Yay! Thank you, Mimic. You, you shouldn't be cursed, though. Come on, now. The rat was pretty good. The rat was pretty decent. Right. The strongest gun of all time, the Scrambler. Of course, it doesn't poison bosses. That's, that's, that's really nice. Makes the synergy almost pointless. Luckily, like I said, the weird egg on its own is good enough to carry. Oh, 
I love the fact that then little mini missiles don't explode. <laughs> if they did, that'd be so annoying. These ones here. They just explode into more shots, but that's like not a problem at all. Oh. I'm having trouble with you. Good tank boy. You tank boy. Gotcha. E. Another easy flawless. I have done it. What's that up there? Oh, really enraging for uh, You're a mimic too. I'm getting better. I'm getting better. Come on now. Die. Cool. Yeah, enraging for is not so good. Not so good. Right. Down to our rush fight. To the place. I belong. In the rat fight. Let's kill the rat fight with the rattler. This should do mucho damage. Why doesn't he pet the snake when he reloads it? So resist. But yeah, we have more than enough health to do this. Unfortunately, we don't have any armor, which is a bit annoying, but well. I've just got my other screen open now. I'm looking at the other synergies, and one of the synergies with the light gun is the one that throws out the dog, and it's just called Egg Murderer. Like, I don't know why, but it's just called Egg Murderer. It's funny. Right. Keep on keeping on. So it's... Right twice, up twice, left twice. Yeah, this is doing pretty good damage. Stop it with your shit. Come on, you. Double right. Oh god, I hate this room so much. Ow. Had a feeling he'd hit me there. I think I got hit by the explosion, actually. Yeah. Yeesh. Up again. I love that room. There's nothing in it. Screw it. I hate this room so much. The perma-jammed champions. Not fun. Let's just kill this guy really quickly. There we go. And this should be it, shouldn't it? It's like on the wrong way. Nice it. Cool. <laughs> Get scrambled to full. Push, take a heart and push one in. Just open the doors first. I always find it easier if I open the doors first. We might as well use the scrambler for the first phase and then the aura gunny if we run out of ammo. I don't think we will though. Sorry rat, I didn't mean to. Candle rat. There we go, it's in. It's in. Oh my god, with Omega Bullets this thing is crazy damage. Omega Bullets plus Chaos Bullets is making this thing just insanely powerful. Oh, I don't have to worry about the poison as well, that's, just, that's so nice. Although, with the poison out, I can't really see where these shots are going, which is not good. Yeah, you're, you're dead, dude. You're dead. Don't even try it. Don't even try it. Bah. Back's full. Yeah. yeah, we only use like 22 shots there. We're going to be fine for the next phase, I should think. Fine, I should think. Might want to stop with that attack, please. I can't believe he started off with the worst attack. I'm, I'm definitely better at this one now, but I'm still not perfect at it. Just got sort of the timing down. I kind of know when the uh, I know when the jumps appear, the um, the, the roll, the times to roll. I know like when they're when they're coming. So as long as I kill the jammed ones, I don't care. Okay, got it. Start up over here and slowly, slowly work my way across. Just stay against the wall, and you should be fine. In the last few, you can make your way up above. Pretty easy, uh, that rocket one. It can sometimes fuck you over because the rockets can sort of move in weird patterns. They're a bit random. But for the most part, if you stay against the wall, you can destroy most of the bullets. Cool. Pretty 
pretty geared going. Yeah, that attack's really easy as well. Just roll left and right constantly. So you start there, push yourself against the wall. Sometimes it won't work because the bullets will come up, up a bit too much, like that. But for the most part, it works pretty well. Oh shit, I killed him with a rattler. I didn't even mean to. Right. Right. Nice, doing a lot of damage here. I feel like dodging, doing a dodge at the start of that attack where he, uh, well that, not that attack, but that bit where he um, like puffs his chest out. Uh, it always means that I end up getting the, um, getting the crit hit. Come on you. Oh, I didn't do it there. I missed out on my opportunity. Got him. The sniper is pretty decent. I'm trying to get the uh, left, right, left, right sort of going. Get a bit more, get a bit more damage on, killing them a little bit quicker. I'm getting better at it, but it's still not perfect. Ow! You hit me twice, you horrible man. Cool. Got you again. Oh, I read um, hot lead is great. I got hit by that shit. How did I get hit by that? Got you. Got you. Oh shit. If you get the left, right, left, right going really well on that, you can keep him stunned for a really long time. Got better with that as well. Cool. Boom! And you're dead. Got the box too. Box lets of steel, but generally not that great. Can't believe his A tier as well. It's it's the worst, it's probably one of the worst A tiers, I think. Unless someone can tell me something about it that I really don't know. A Mega Bullet just, uh, plus Hot Lead just means that it always um, gives us the Hot Lead effect. Check this to Synergy. There is not. Hey. Hey now, game. That's not fair. Had to just destroy it for Trick Gun. God damn it. No weird egg for us. No rhymes allowed. Scramble Amble Amber Amber. And Rattler, I guess. Cool. Zorgon's decent. Yeah, no, this, 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 the part of the challenge was no rhymes allowed, which I think is fair because they are overpowered as shit. I'll just go down, skip straight to the fifth floor. Like I said, I don't think we need the fourth floor stuff, so I think we're good enough where we are now. And then we'll just use this. We now have the ability to steal yet again, um, even though we don't particularly need it. I just get it by a jam bullet, even if it did, it doesn't really matter. I've got, um, I've got protection. I've got armor. Uh, but yeah, um, might as well just do this and then like, open up the rooms with it, so we can position ourselves correctly, maybe. Might help. Hopefully. I think. Cool. Should I just use it before the room. And we can like barrel stuff some enemies. Insta kill them basically. Come here, you. Get poisoned. Yeah. 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 Yeesh. Um, let's go wheeze me. That didn't work at all. Wait, just one second. Did that trigger our um, infuriating rage? No, it didn't. No, it didn't. I just saw us go red, but maybe that was just a little lacking from when we did get hit. Like, sort of lasted a bit longer than I thought it would. Infuriating rage. I meant infuriating no, by the way. Not infuriating rage. Why couldn't we have found the boss fight that fast when we we're going for our speed run? God damn it, game. Oh, we've got a synergy lady. That's something to spend our mullet on. We'll find our blacksmith first, though, because blacksmiths could be more important. Thank God that isn't a red guy. The jammed red ones are so annoying. Cool. Nice. And a key. 
which we don't need. I'm, I do need the ammo though, so I will, I will go across there really briefly. God damn it, I missed the train. Quit! Quit! Let me off. I know there's snipers up here. Gotcha. And there's a bullet shark? Yeah. Bullet shark. Gotcha. Nice. Ooh, a shop of some sort, of some kind. A key shop? Um, I'll just, do you know what? I'll just take the bracket key. Increase curse, a bit more damage, and obviously be able to kill rooms instantly, which is pretty nice. We don't need the A key at all, so just do that. Yeah, if you didn't know, the bracket key is S tier. Not because of the damage it deals, but because it ends every single phase of the room. So say the room has four, like, four spawns of enemies, four waves of enemies. It ends the room right there and then. You don't have to do, oh shit, I got stuck on the table. You don't have to do all four phases. It's really, really good. Especially on floors like this and bullet hell and things like that. Old Knight's helmet. Um, I guess we'll take this extra armor. The rest we don't need. I'm gonna synergy lady, see if we can get something cool from her. What you got for us, bitch? Give us something derp and cool and cool and derp. No synergy. Just the cult. Cult 45. I keep on using the uh, the rattler. The rattler's just derp. I just love it. Such a fun item to use. We get poison, we get fire, we get good damage. It's all good. It's all good, man. It's all good. Yeah, these guys you want to kind of stay still and then move when they shoot rather than moving sporadically because otherwise they'll fire like god knows where. Yeah, no. Didn't want to deal with that shit. Oh, definitely don't want to deal with this shit. What? Nope. Don't want to deal with your hand bullshit. Still haven't seen the hand shoot on um on on the video yet. I've I've seen it once before while I've been playing normally, but I've never seen it on on like this channel yet. Strange. By the way, um, I did mention about doing a Black Ops 4 tutorial, like not tutorial, sorry, like review. And I think I am going to do that. It might take me like a, a decent amount of time before it's out, just because I've got to gather gameplay and get together what I'm going to say and all that sort of stuff. I have written a review already, so I can use that review to sort of talk from. Uh, but I, I don't know. It could be like it could be like a week or so before it comes out. I really don't know. It depends on depends on how, if I get the chance. Like I might not even get around to it. I'd like to. But it really depends on how busy I am. Like, I'm, I'm fairly busy with work this week, so I'll have to see, like, sort of what time I have to do it. But it would be nice to do. I think it'd be, like like someone said, it'd be a good way to introduce new people to my channel. Same with, like, when I do Into the Gungeon. I'm probably going to do, like, a mini review of that, like, sort of a welcome to, um, not Into the Gungeon, sorry, Binding of Isaac. Sort of a welcome to Binding of Isaac uh, video, just to get people introduced to the game before I play it, because I know that some of you out there may not have played it. The majority of you have, but I know that some of you haven't. Alright, let's scramble this boy. Scramble this guy's brains. Oh, he's jammed. He's jammed. Nice. Alright, let's do that. What a nice way to start the day off. Jammed dragon. If I start the day off, by the way, I mean, I've literally just woken up. Like, start this episode. Oh, damn it. Luckily, we've got armor. I did blank there, uh, so that was kind of stupid. Like, I thought I could be thought I could be cool and stay in there as long as possible and then blank, but I should have just blanked straight away, shouldn't I? I'm a fool. With my pants on the ground. Okay, this is a fairly easy attack to dodge. There we go. Nice. There's only a few attacks that I really have problems with him. There we go. Got rid of the knives. That's nice. For the most part, we're pretty okay. And even though the uh, him being jammed gives him 30% extra health, it's not that bad. It's our first actual uh, failed flawless there. Uh, we didn't obviously get the 4 4 flawless because we didn't go to it. And unfortunately, we uh, got hit there. But it doesn't particularly matter because we got monster blood. Damn it. Hit again. Shit. We got hit way too many times there. Way too many times. 
So I reckon we bracket key then there, just scramble the shit out of it. I don't think we have any better weapons for it, do we? We might have some better weapons for it. Yeah, the Oregon is a lot better. Damn it. Yeah, the bracket key did good work there. Really don't want to get hit by these bullets because they are jammed, jammed a Rooney, so they will do full hard damage. What? And ho it. Got him. Probably use the Oregon yeah. Throw out some, some of the next few rooms of bullet health. Bracket key's going to be a huge help. Right, yeah, no flawless. And let's quickly go back to our shop and pick up anything that's useful to us. Like ammo. And head on back now, y'all. Yeah, I'm going to use the Oregon for a bit. Probably, might, probably use the Zorgon too. But the Oregon is going to be probably our best room clearer. Or a map, even, should I be saying. No! Oh, I have fallen and I can't get up. To bullet hell. It's been a pretty good run so far. Like, considering we've not opened a single chest, we have a lot of items. This just shows sort of the power of the rat. Like, of going to fight the rat. Like, obviously it helps that I flawless the majority of my bosses, it helps that I got monster blood, and it helps that I've had so many good NPCs too, but, like, that isn't the only factor, like, I've had a good run for doing this really, but, again, like I said, it's not the only factor. And luckily we don't have Lord of the Jammed on our back, which is very nice. Look how much junk we have, goddamn. Would have had, we could have had a, uh, four more junk there. I'm pr pretty sure we got junk from every chest we uh, tried to open. Hey, you. You got way too close there. Just trying to avoid this dude. Don't think you're cool just because you, you hit me once. I'll probably get some health at some point anyway, so... Certain rooms I'm going to do that on. Oh, I really hate that it doesn't kill these guys. Got an extra blank. That makes up for the loss of health. An extra blank is very, very nice. I like at least three blanks to fight the Lich, so that kind of puts us at that position. Can you please die? Oh shit. Bouncy, ow. God damn it, Bouncy boy. I knew he was going to get me. I just done knew it. Alright, there we go. As long as we can get rid of the annoying enemies quickly. Yeah, the jammed enemies are going to be the death of us, if anything, but I think we should be okay. We can do things like that and just end rooms instantly, which is very nice. Whenever we see a room that's, like, fairly large, or we know is fairly annoying, we just end it straight away. That's, that's the dealio. Yeah. There we go. Just get rid of the, all the enemies that shoot and take out these guys on their own. Fire should get him, yeah. The ticks of fire damage actually kill them pretty quick, pretty easily. It's nice. I don't know if we're going the right way here. I was firing two shots then, I don't know why. This looks like the wrong way, but I'll go through it anyways. I'll go through it anyways. Yeah, this, this room isn't particularly hard enough. It's the, it's the ones with jammed enemies we need to be getting rid of quickly. Or the ones we know have, like, um, what they're called. Uh, we, are, we are sometimes firing two shots, I don't know why. Um, the ones we know have shot grubs, the rooms we want to be taking out quickly. Like, this room's fairly easy from what I remember. It's got these guys, which can be annoying. I had to get hit by one as well. It's even more annoying. But for the most part, it's just easy dodges. I am getting hit by the bouncy shot. The shotgun boys a lot more than I normally do, actually. Like, that, that's an easy end one there. Let's game end them. Hmm. This looks like it could be the wrong way. It is the wrong way. Nice. Yep. Knew it. Getting hit a lot here. Really shouldn't be getting hit this much. Not at all. Fucking goddammit. So many of these guys in this room. I know there's a shot group down below, but at the minute I don't want to deal with them. Right, 
right, there we go. Oop, health as well. Get down there before the short group shots come back to get us. Come back to bed us in the boot. This room does definitely not need the um, bracket key. It would be a fool's game to use that thing. Right, there we go. Should just make it before it shoots again. Indeed we will. Again, not a room where we need um, we need to use the thingy particularly. Bracket key. Small room. Small enemies. Probably spawns a bigger enemy at the end, but yeah. Two gem ones are these, but they're not that bad actually. Oh my god, they are when they hit us with a gem bullet though. Holy shit. I'm getting hit by enemies I swear I never get hit, hit by. It's just the, the, the peer pressure of this run. It's too much. Too much, man. It's too much. Thank you for dying quickly. And you too. Put. Yeah, that room's horrible. End that room straight a fucking way. Basically, that room has the um, the four shot grubs in it. So, doesn't look as bad when you initially get in there. Just got one measly bullet in, and then it throws it all at you. This room always sucks ass. Oh, health. Yes. Oh, yes. We're bringing it back. We're bringing it back now, y'all. Are you still alive? Yes, you are. Don't be jammed. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I always go the wrong way on this one. Always go the two wrong ways. Okay, not enough jammed enemies to make it worthwhile. Poopulon. You know you know what I mean. You know what I'm gonna say. Fuck off. Fuck off and da da da. How'd I miss all them shots? Damn aim assist. Again, another fairly easy room. We don't need to use a bracket key for this one. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Oh, my God. Them things are really annoying me this time around. They never normally cause me any issues. Come on, you. Just get into a position where I can shoot you easily. There we go. There we go. Told you I go the two wrong ways. I think it, like, generates so you do that on purpose. So you always go the wrong ways. Cool. Makes that room much, much easier. Then the boss room's always like a few rooms off this way, so. Not so bad. Not so bad. Gotcha. People on? Don't think so. Oh shit, I got hit by a jammed fucking beanie boy. So I got too fucking complacent and rolled. Shit. We're on, we're on pretty low health now, actually, so. Scrambler's going to be our best friend here. Same with bracket key. Just spam bracket key as much as we can. Kill these guys as quick as possible. Yeah, we should be able to kill him fairly quickly. Not, not super quick, but... We should at least be able to do it without getting hit on this phase. I just say, I, I, don't, I don't know, I say that, but then, then I get hit, so. <laughs> there we go, we're doing, we're doing all right, we're doing all right. Yeah, we got, we got, we didn't get hit on that phase. That, that burns very well for us. No blanks are used, no hits taken. That puts us in a very favorable spot, really. We are, um, we're set to, we're set to, I won't say win, but we're set to do well. Like, we'd have to get hit a lot on the uh, on the second phase, which is where I normally get hit a lot, so it could happen. Oh, and he's jammed as well, you bitch. You bitch. You just had to be jammed, didn't you? Let's just do that. The thing is, like I said as well, it takes us much longer to kill him when he's jammed like this too, so... And this attack is a pain in the ass. I, I, can, I can do this without blanking. Like, a lot of the time, I just find it scary. Right. Look at the bracket keys doing good, good work for us. That attack's usually fairly normal. Oh, we're alright, we're alright. I'm trying to use as little blanks as possible. 
I had to use one there. Cool, we got him, we got him. I had to use one there, just because he it combined two really annoying attacks. And you just can't do anything when he does that. Right, so... I like to just stand, go directly below him straight away. And hope he doesn't do that. Fucking really. He's a blank straight away. Can't end any of his attacks now. It's really annoying when he does attacks like the rocket. What the fuck? Um... What the shit is this? Please, please disperse. Damn it. Stupid attack. Um, how did I fucking survive that? I was like directly in the center of all the bullets and didn't get hit once. But you know what? You're dead now. So I don't have to give a shit about what you say. Ker fucking blammer. You're Dunion Rings. That's what you are. Dunion Rings. That was a, a fairly... A fairly spicy run, not a single chest opened. And still got a Lich win. I think that was a cool challenge. I think that was a cool challenge. Well, I'm really happy we didn't get any red or black chests that run. That would have made me cry a bit. <laughs> but yeah, no chest opened. Still got the win. I think I think I, I think that's pretty a pretty dope run. And we've also killed one dragon out of our possible out of our five for our challenge. We've actually we're on a decent win streak at the minute, from what I recall. Like, let me just let me just briefly check. Like, right, if I just go to my channel now. Hello, um, everybody, and welcome back to the Instagram. Um, so we're we're on like a we're on like an eleven win no twelve win streak at the minute. I think one no one two three four yeah so one. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. We're on a twelve wins streak right now. Hot diggity damn. Right, cool. I'm high. Let's just go check our frightful, make sure that counted. It definitely did, but I just want to make sure. Four dragons. So four more runs. So episode episode 80, 86 will be when we've completed the challenges, and then we just gotta find them. So yeah. I hope you guys enjoyed. I enjoyed that run very much. Thank you for the challenge suggestion. If you have any more ideas that aren't too out of this world, slash need modded gun junks, we'll do them after. Then leave them in the, either, my dis, uh, either my comments or drop them in the Discord and the suggestions tab. And I'll have a look at doing them. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed and I'll see you guys in the next one.